Welcome back to Creative Glam. If you're new here, hello and welcome. If you're returning, thank you and welcome back. Today, I am super excited because I am hosting the DIY Kitchen Countertop Decor Collab. I sure hope that you like the way this project turns out. And if you do, leave me a comment down below in the comment section. And I would also love it if you gave me a big thumbs up. Make sure you hit that subscribe button below along with the notification bell. Hit the notification bell twice so that you don't miss out on any of my future videos. Now my thinking behind this collab was that with it being uh, with holidays coming up and with the turn of the seasons, this would be a great time to put together some kitchen vignettes to kind of decorate your countertops that match your tablescape. I love doing vignettes. They're super easy. They're inexpensive. You can shop your home and come up with some really nice things. And even if you have to pick up one or two things for the, the current season or the current holiday, it's not too expensive. I want to thank everyone for tuning in today. And I want to thank the content creators for participating in this collaboration. I will leave a link down below to the playlist of the other participants in this collaboration. Make sure you stop by and check them out too after you finish watching my video. Again, thanks for watching and thanks for participating. Let me show you my vignette, my DIY kitchen countertop decor. Let's go. I'm going to take my large milk vase. I got this vase from Target. I'm going to create a simple lavender arrangement and I'm going to duplicate the same arrangement in the small milk vase. I got that from TJ Maxx. And now I'm going to place the cake stand. I got that from Home Goods. And here I'm adding my spring shadow box picture frame. I'll link that video up above. And now I'll just place my Ray Dunn candle bloom. And here I'll place the crushed glass sphere, which I got from Home Goods. And here I'll place the faux eucalyptus. I got that from TJ Maxx. And then last but not least is the welcome sign. And I got that from Target. And that's it guys. I'm all done. My DIY kitchen countertop decor for spring.
okay guys, that's it. We're all done. I like the way it turned out. And if you enjoyed it too, leave me a comment down below in the comment section. And I'd love it if you gave me a big thumbs up. Again, I thank you all for watching and I thank you all for participating. It was lots of fun. Now I'm gonna go take a look at everyone's video. But before I go, make sure you hit the subscribe button below, along with the notification bell. Hit that notification bell twice so that you'll be notified when I upload new videos and I upload new videos multiple times a week. Also, when you get a chance, stop by my second channel, Creative Glam Crafts. I will leave a link to that channel down below along with the playlist. And stay tuned for the upcoming subscriber giveaway. And with that being said, you have a blessed day. And I'll see you right back here next time on Creative Glam. Bye.